What's up, pizza lovers? My name is Peter Pepper. I'm Tony Roney. And you're watching Eat Pizza Pizza. I don't know. I keep feeling like I'm in an Alfred Hitchcock movie. We travel the greater New York area and the world to try the best pizza slices as recommended by locals. Locals meaning people just like you who contact people just like us and say, Pita, Tony, Peppa, Roni, you, you gotta, gotta try, try this, this place. place. Today we're here trying Little Max Pizza in Point Pleasant Beach, New Jersey. This was recommended by our pizza lover, Mary. I have had this place before, have you? I have never even seen this store before. Really? Yeah. Yes. So today we're gonna be trying it and giving you our unbiased review and rating the pizza on our three pizza point system, each on a scale up to five. Number one is? Crust. Number two is? Sauce. Number three is? Cheese. Let's go order some pizza. Let's see what it looks like. Oh, Ooh, wow. This Just is like large. I remember. Oh, did we even get plates? Uh, we, we did, did not, not get, get plates. plates. And they just closed. Well, what are you going to eat the plate? This is really big. And getting the whole pie is a real bargain compared to buying it by the slice. Mm -hmm. The slice is expensive. The slice is $5.75 yeah. and the whole pie is $30. Worth it to get That's the pie. That's a big difference. Cheers. Cheers. Pizza, pizza toast. Okay. That pizza integrity is a no go. Oh my gosh. This is. I've never tasted a crust like this one before. Never. Look at the crust. Even the crust is like soiled in oil. Soiled in oil. Soiled in oil. It's messy. But tasty. Playful cheese. Mm -hmm. Nice flavor to the cheese. A questionable design. When I came last, it was a much better crust. Really? Mm -hmm. So you're saying it's early in the season, maybe, maybe. the crustmeister hasn't had enough practice yet? So you don't care for the crust? I, I don't care for the crust. No. It's so disappointing. It's kind of really an awful taste because my, look at how much oil is on my hands now. There's a distinct flavor to this crust that I cannot place. Mm. It tastes... It tastes like it was fried. Do you want your slice, crusty? My one slice? I thought that's all mine. There's enough pizza here for the whole boardwalk. Well, actually, let's be careful because it's very oily. Yours is oily. I have integrity. Wow, wow look at that. Now it's bending. Well, it doesn't taste like most any other pizza we've had. Mm -hmm. It's oily. Uh -huh. It's good. Peter, you don't look too pleased. I'm so disappointed. This was not how it tasted when I came last time. But we have to, we ate it, now we have to rate yep, it. Yep, based on what we got today. But look at all the oil that just stripped off of it. I, I, we're gonna start off, number one crust, but I'm so disappointed in this pizza. Mm. This whole crust was soggy at the bottom and had such a fried quality to it. Almost like they doused it in oil as it was coming out. It is not a good slice and it was good. I'm gonna clarify, but today it is a very distasteful slice. Let's hope we just came on a bad day. Yeah. I hate to diss a place, especially at the start of the season when, you know, boardwalk businesses are dependent on about 12 good weeks of business mm. and then that's it for the year. But I'm wondering, is the pizza oven like Greasy. Greasy? A 0.5. Wow. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Yeah, I, I gotta say, I mean, on a scale of one being why bother to a scale of five, which is perfection, I gotta give it a one. Um, number two, sauce. Sauce. The whole pizza is too salty, but the sauce in itself was all right. Two. Yeah, I'm gonna give it a two as well. There was no 
flavor that shined through. There's no sweet quality to it. There's nothing that made you think, oh, the sauce is here. Functioning subpar. Yeah. Yeah. And last, cheese. 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 Today, salty, um, but also very playful it and was stringy. Playful. Yes. And I just wish that the rest of the crust allowed you to actually play with it and didn't like slap you in the face from how wiggly it was. But the cheese was particularly oily today. It was oily. Like, the whole like, thing was oily. I would say don't hold uh, an open flame too close to this pizza. Mm -mm. So, rating for the cheese, I think I'm going to give it a three. That's exactly what I want to give it. It was a good average cheese on the oily side, but playful. Mm -hmm. so, so oil brings it down, playfulness brings it up. So yeah. it's, it's just yeah. average. Average. Yeah. average. Five seventy-five for a slice of pizza. It's not a slice worth the price. If it's this slice, you are going to get the whole pie. That slice was definitely worth a four-dollar slice, but it comes out to like three eighty for a pie. Yeah, the pie was thirty bucks. Mm -hmm. But. And I could have spent it better elsewhere. I'm sorry. If you're someone who loves Little Max, that you also have fond memories of this place, but today it really could have just been a yeah. It could have been an off day. It could have been the last the last pie on the way out. They are closed. They're closed right now. now. And you know this is just two guys' opinions mm -hmm. and two guys in a crusty opinion. But I would also like to add that we weren't even given plates, True. which is kind of like. A service thing too, um, so it's just it just felt like it was a rushed pie. Like we ordered it within four minutes. They wanted it was to out. go home. Yeah, it tastes like a pie that was left to the end of the day, or maybe these were the leftover slices. If you look at it, no, 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 no. Okay, <laughs> this is a pie. This is a pie. Um, <laughs> leftover slices. I don't know. Oh, they staple them together. <laughs> he asked me, "Do you want napkins?" I said, "No, we have. It's a good thing." I'm Peter Peppa. I'm Tony Roney. Thank you for watching. Come visit us again. And let us know your favorite pizza spot down below. And as always, don't forget, you can never eat too much pizza. Oh.